Did you know that kinetic and potential energy is all around us? Hi everyone, this is Mr. Lara, and in this video we will learn about kinetic and potential energy. So what is energy? We define energy as the ability to do work or the ability to change. Change in energy can take place in various forms. For example, when energy is applied to a system, there can be changes in temperature, chemical structure, or the speed or position of an object. All energy within a system is classified as either potential or kinetic energy and is measured in the unit joule. A unit joule represents the amount of energy needed in order for change to take place within a system. We define potential energy as stored energy, while kinetic energy is energy that is in motion. There are four types of potential energy. Gravitational potential energy, such as a child on a slide, a ball at the top of a hill, or a hammer that is raised. Elastic potential energy, such as a stretched spring or rubber band and a stretched bow. There's chemical energy, stored energy found in fossil fuels, sunlight captured by plants, energy stored within a battery, or energy stored in calories in the food that we eat. There's also nuclear energy, potential energy stored in the nucleus of an atom. These are all examples of stored energy. Kinetic energy is energy that is in motion or that involves movement. Some types of kinetic energy are mechanical energy, such as cycling, riding a skateboard, and driving a car. Electrical energy, the movement of electrically charged particles within a closed circuit that powers electronic devices. Sound energy, energy that moves and travels in sound waves, such as a speaker, blaring. Radiant energy, the electromagnetic energy that travels through sunlight, radio waves, and x-rays. And thermal energy, the heating of objects that cause atoms and molecules to vibrate, move rapidly, and collide with each other. Kinetic energy involves motion, such as a ball rolling down a hill, a book falling from a table, or throwing a ball. So what makes all types of energy special? All forms of energy can never be created or destroyed, but rather only transferred between an object or a system. Potential energy can transform into kinetic energy, and kinetic energy can also change into potential energy. For example, if you are to be at the top of a hill on a bicycle, you would have the greatest amount of potential energy or energy that is stored. The minute you start to go down the hill, the stored energy is transformed to kinetic energy or energy of movement due to the force of gravity. As kinetic energy increases going down the hill, potential energy decreases. Another example of potential energy transforming into kinetic energy can be seen in a roller coaster. The roller coaster, as it starts from rest at the top, has the most potential energy. When the roller coaster is released and begins to be pulled down by gravity, its stored energy is transformed into kinetic energy. As the roller coaster goes down the hill, its kinetic energy increases while its potential energy decreases.